Hello. Hello. Uh, I'm not a public speaker, so I'm going to try my best not to faint. If I faint, do take me to the hospital, please. Uh, so good evening, everyone. Uh, I'm sure most of you don't know me. Uh, I'm Tristan Wilson. I am Stevens younger but bigger brother. Uh, on this very special day, we are all here to celebrate the wedding of Stevin Wilson and Amla Chirail Wilson. Can we please have a round of applause for them, please? <laughs> Woo! Uh, when Stevin asked me to be his best man today, I knew that it was a tough decision for him, me being his only brother and the only close friend who has who was able to attend it. So I know it was hard for you. Uh, like Chako Chin said in Akarakar Chagal, when you said my name, <laughs> uh, So actually, Stevin has no idea what happens in a toast. So he told me yesterday that he expects to hear good things about him. So I'm going to try to do that, but I don't promise you anything. Uh, According to reliable sources, I met Stevin in the 90s at a hospital in Kerala. Uh, so, he, uh, from all these years, I can say that we are different kind of people. Uh, we are the straight opposites. Uh, Stevin is a mature and well-planned guy. He has been planning this night for four or five months till now with Amla. I wrote this page yesterday night. <laughs> Yeah, uh, Stevin has always been smart and studious, or I like to call it nerdy. Uh, he would cry if he gets a 3.9 GPA. I would give a party if I get a three. Uh, Stevin is a very formal person. Uh, so we live together even now. I'm 25, he's 28. We live together, we are roommates. He, he goes out to throw his garbage wearing suits or shirts all tucked in. That's the kind of guy he is. And I, like, I work uh, at home, so I, I usually attend meetings and boxes for the past one year, so we are the straight opposite. Um, Stevin eats when he's hungry. You might see from me, I eat when I'm bored. Uh, my email address is sincewilson at gmail.com. I'm not proud of it. Stevin says, Dr. Stevin Wilson, PhD at gmail.com. <laughs> Don't spam him. Don't send him mails. He's not going to reply. Uh, actually, sorry. I have to interrupt this speech to say something that my mom asked me to say. Uh, she wants me to say that Stevin is kind, <laughs> handsome, generous, passionate, caring. It's a long list. If I can still go on. Mom, can I stop? Actually, Steven is the darling child of our family, and I'm the silly one, so I'm sure that my dad is going to spank me after this for making fun of his favorite child. <laughs> Please don't do that, dad. Uh, the only thing that he is I can be proud of is Steven still looks up to me. It's just because I'm a little bit taller than him. <laughs> um, so it's all been Steven till now. Let's go to Chechi. Uh, to start off, does, doesn't she look stunning today? Please. Yeah. Woo! Uh, from the time that I've known her, I've understood that she's very humble, uh, down to earth, beautiful, and respectful. I've seen only one flow in her, and that's her taste in men. <laughs> Actually, no, I'm just kidding. There are nice things, Stevin. Uh, fun fact. Stevin's favorite color is pink. So, JJ, if you ever wanted to live in a Barbie doll house with pink mats, pink curtains, pink carpets, your wish just came true. Uh, he does try a, lot, try a lot for her. I've seen him try to become Gordon Ramsay for all the times that they plan to eat at home. Uh, he never really goes out with me, but when she's here, he becomes Bear Grylls, fully adventurous. Uh, Stevin and I have had fights since our childhood. Of course, we are brothers. So, JJ, I've taught him to ask for forgiveness, even if he's the one at fault. So, you can use that. Uh, 
Stephanie is going to spend a lot of time talking to you, like romantic topics like uh, deep learning or <laughs> programming languages that you write in. Uh, fun thing, like when Stevin met my best friend Ricky, if you are seeing this, hi. He, when he met him for the first time, the first question that he asked Ricky was, uh, how, how worried Ricky was about the government tracking his OnePlus device and the programming languages that Ricky usually quotes in. So that's his small talk. So you can expect a lot of that from him. <laughs> and I know all the Silicon Valley people out here, I've heard you talk about all this in parties and gatherings. I hate it, but <laughs> Steven is the right man for you. Uh, we are jokes apart. I haven't seen Steven happier than when he is with you. Uh, this makes us as a whole family really happy. Um, I'm very confident that you guys have found the perfect match for each other. Um, the oldest memory that I have of Steven is from a photograph where I as an infant is lying in bed and he being the big and bulky bro is, is lying next to me all cuddled up and taking care of me. Uh, over the last 28, 25 years, I have felt that same warmth from Stevin. He has always cared for me. Uh, he's more like a guardian to me than a brother. Um, and I'm sure that you're going to feel the same way with Stevin. Uh, I teared up after like two and a half years with happiness today in the church. That's how happy I am for you guys. Um, I love you both. I formally welcome you to the Teke Parambil family. I formally welcome you, you to the even more smaller Crispin's household. And also, I welcome you to South Carolina. Woo! Woo! Uh, as a membership ritual, we'll make sure that she gains an additional 10 pounds in the first month itself. Uh, I know you're all hungry, so I'd like to end by saying this. Steven, let me say how lucky you are. You will leave here today having gained a wife who is warm, loving and caring. A wife who is funny, makes you happy, and radiates beauty wherever she goes. I'm sure you feel on top of the world now. And Teji, how lucky you are that you live here today with a wonderful dress and a gorgeous bouquet. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I love you too. Steven is the best brother in the world and he'll be the best husband in the world. Uh, now, if I may ask all of you to please raise your glasses and join me for a toast. The newlyweds couples, Steven Wilson and Amala Cheryl Wilson. God bless you guys. Lots and lots of love. Toast. Cheers. Woo! Let me hear it. Woo!